What is creative destruction? Creative destruction in economics refers to the process in which new companies replace obsolete and inefficient ones that fail. We also refer to this process as Schumpeter's Gale. The term refers to capitalism's ability to innovate, destroy and then reinvent itself. In nature, winter kills off weak life forms, thus making space for new ones to take their place in spring. Innovation in our economy creates the new life forms which displace the outdated ones. In a creative destruction cycle, old firms and industries which are not profitable anymore close down. Their destruction enables the resources to move into more productive processes. Resources in this context refers to capital and labour. The term creative destruction was coined by Joseph Schumpeter, an Austrian political economist, in 1942 who considered it the essential fact about capitalism. Music and creative destruction. In the music industry, people initially bought vinyl records to listen to their favorite tunes and songs. When cassette tapes came onto the market, vinyl sales fell until they completely disappeared from shops. CDs did the same thing to cassette tapes. Today, the CD market is vanishing in the same way because consumers are downloading music or using streaming services. This is an example of three industries dying after new ones were created. In a free market economy, new businesses emerge and old ones die naturally. It is a similar process to what we all see in nature. Only by respecting the creative destruction process can innovation, creativity and progress thrive. If we interfere with this process by subsidising a major failing company, that industry and its consumers suffer. Thank you for watching this brief video on creative destruction.